Alright, so today I'm going to be showing you how to fix a simple problem that you might have with your bike or with any other kind of machinery you use in your daily life. So, if you look right here, you can see my crank is super loose. Now, this is not a one-time issue. Um, this crank comes loose about like every day or two that I ride. So today, I'm going to be showing you an easy way that you can just fix it and not have to worry about it at least for a few months. What we're going to use is this stuff called thread locker. There's different tiers of it. You can see this is the red one. So this is automotive grade. So basically what this stuff is, is it's like super glue for your bolts. It's designed to be used in places like that crank to basically apply it on there, then you screw it in and it's just going to lock it in place. So all you're going to need to fix this problem is whatever size, you need to take out that threaded uh, bolts or whatever and then you're just going to need a little bit of thread locker so I'm going to show you how to apply it right now first we're going to take out the bolt so these Odyssey Thunderbolt cranks have kind of a flaw design because you can see how short this is and that's supposed to hold in both sides of those cranks because there's nothing on the other side I know a lot of people have this problem with these cranks so today I'm going to show you how you can at least temporarily resolve it all I'm going to do is Shake this up, just make sure it's all good and mixed. And then I'm going to apply this by removing the cap. And you want to make sure you get it on there uh, evenly all around, just so that it's you know it's held in place. And um, as long as you put it on while it's wet, you don't really need to do the whole thing because as long as you do the first part, that's going to hit and it's going to rub off. So like it's going to get in there no matter what. So now that I have this all applied on there, Let's get it on the bike. Same thing we did unscrewing it, just now we're screwing it back in. Now when you put it back on, you wanna make sure you get it good and tight because once you leave it there, it's gonna be pretty much stuck in position. So you don't wanna have it be permanently loose. Obviously you can uh, use some elbow grease and manhandle it out of there if you need to, but it's just better for the cranks and for your purposes to just make sure it's tight the first time. All right, so now that you've applied it, you're going to want to give it a few hours to dry before you ride just to make sure that it's all set and done before you pick up your bike because if you pick up your bike and you start riding and it becomes loose again, it's going to get stuck loose and you don't want that. So just give it a few hours and then um, you should be good. So thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe if you're new here. If you notice, I did change the name of my channel to just my name because um, I didn't really know what to put it as. CF3BMX kind of didn't really stand for anything. It sounded all right, I guess, but it didn't really stand for anything. So... If you have any name suggestions, drop it down in the comments below and I'll see you guys in the next video.